Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel. Look at me, I'm driving again in the car, another car vlog. What is this? This is like the fifth day that I'm vlogging. Am I a daily vlogger now? Am I a daily vlogger? No, I don't think so. That's not gonna happen. I am not a daily vlogger. I am not committing to daily vlogging anytime soon. <laughs> No, but seriously guys, good morning. I hope you guys are having a very good day. Right now, it's about to be 11, and I am heading to, wait for this, I'm heading to my new job. I forgot to tell you guys that I got the job, so they called me two days ago for the second interview. They interviewed me for a second time. They called me later that same day, telling me that I got the job and that I should go today, Monday, to go sign the contract and um, go for like the last um, information on everything. So like they could tell me like everything, how much I'm gonna get paid, what days I'm gonna work, if it's gonna be uh, part-time, uh, full-time. So right now I don't know the full details to everything, but hopefully everything's gonna sound great. They said that everything is negotiable as well. So I'm very excited. So yes, look at me. I am on my way to my new job as a graphic designer at a surf shop. That is kind of really cool. <laughs> so right now the plan is for me just to go over there to sign the contract. Um, they'll tell me like all the information like I said and they'll give me like a full rundown of the whole store and what I'm going to be doing and everything like that. So I don't think I'm going to start work today. I'll probably start work tomorrow. Um, after that, I don't know what I'm going to be doing for the rest of the day today. I don't really have any plans for Lost in Paradise. Um, so I don't know if I will continue vlogging today. Maybe I won't and I'll just continue tomorrow and just add today and the next day together. So let's see what happens. You guys will just catch on while you see the vlog. <laughs> but but yes, this is this is very exciting that I am driving to my new job. Look at me. I have a new job. My phone keeps falling per usual, so I I think I'm just gonna stop vlogging in the car until I get a car mount for my phone. I think that's a better idea. I think I'm gonna do that. <laughs> Hello guys, it's been a while. Right now it's three o'clock and I just came out of my first day of work. So I actually did kind of start it today. I didn't really start working working per se. It was mostly, like I said, um, signing contracts and all that all that stuff and just getting familiarized with the store. So the store is, it's more than what I thought it, it was. Um, it's actually more of a like outdoor sports good kind of store because they have a lot of things. They sell a lot more things than just kayaks and paddle boards and surfboards, which is really cool. It was interesting because they gave me like all everything that I'm gonna be doing, so I'm practically gonna be like um, head of marketing and graphic designing, which is super cool. I feel like I'm gonna tell you guys this, but don't tell anybody else that I told you this. But I kind of feel like I have imposter syndrome because I don't feel like I'm worthy to have this job. I don't know, I feel like I'm not good enough for this job and you know, I feel like, what am I doing there? This is like, I'm not ready for it. Even though I know I I know I could do everything and I, I think I'm a really good graphic designer, um, but I feel like I'm not good enough for this job, I don't know. It's just me like overthinking stuff and anxiety. Other than having imposter syndrome, um, I just need to like get used to the workspace, like working somewhere else that's not in my house and not working for myself because I haven't worked for another company for 
for a really long time, more than a year. So, yeah, I just have to get like familiarized, feel comfortable with everybody there also, but I'm happy. I'm really grateful, super, super grateful. Thank God that I got this job because it's something that I really wanted. And everything seems, like I said, even though I have imposter syndrome, I know I could do everything and I have the talent for it and the knowledge for it as well. Um, but yeah, also I'm gonna be working from Monday to Friday and it's just a part-time job, which is really good because I also still wanna have time that I could dedicate for my own brand and my other small businesses like my photography and my graphic design. So yes, I feel like everything is working out really well and I'm really happy. So I think that I will not be vlogging today for the rest of the day because I don't really have anything else um, to really do. Today I'm gonna take the day off for Lost in Paradise. I'm not gonna be working with Lost in Paradise. Um, I'll probably continue with that tomorrow and I'll probably just add this vlog with the next one. So yeah, I will catch you guys the next day that I vlog. I don't know if it'll be tomorrow or in a few days. I don't know, but you will see me in the same day. <laughs> I yet have not bought a car mount, so we're just gonna pray that this doesn't fall because I'm on the highway. <laughs> Good morning guys, welcome to another day. Today is Thursday 17. I don't even know what day is today, what number of the week is today. Um, hello, you are watching this in the same vlog of me starting a new job. I have not vlogged during the day. I mean, I have not vlogged during the week a lot. So I vlogged on Monday and now I'm vlogging today. I've been a little bit busy with the new job and all, which I'll get to in a second. Um, but yes, I decided to vlog today, even though today there's not a lot happening. And I don't know what else I'm going to vlog during the day. I don't really have a lot to do, like with Lost in Paradise today. Um, during the weekend, I'll get ready for the event, which is happening on Sunday. But yeah, not much has happened during the week. Um, I'll just do a little recap of how it's going at my new job, which is really cool. I'm really happy with it. I, it's, it's very exciting still. Obviously it's very new. I've only been working for three days. Today I didn't work because I had a doctor's appointment. Uh, well, I had therapy, which we'll get to in a second as well. But, but yeah, it's been going really well me at the job i'm really enjoying it i it's a lot of work because i'm basically the marketing director and graphic designer for two stores so i'm basically working for the brand as a whole not only for one store and like i said it's a sporting like a outdoors sporting um store like they sell sporting goods and water sports kind of stuff so they have two stores around the island and I'm basically doing the marketing and the graphics for both stores, which is really cool because I've been doing a lot of ads and a lot of designs and um, I've been working on a Christmas catalog for this new season, this uh, new holiday season, which has been, it's been really fun and I've really enjoyed it, even though it is a lot of, a lot of work. It's what I do, it's what I studied, it's what I'm passionate about. I'm passionate about art, I'm passionate about graphics and digitals and everything that has to do with that. So I'm really happy with the job right now. Today I didn't go to work because I had um, therapy in the morning. Right now it's about like, it's gonna be 12 um, p.m. So I'm heading out of therapy right now and I decided to vlog because while I was in therapy, my therapist said something that was so true and that I need to tell myself that she was telling me this so I could like live by this and and it was just like some words that really got me thinking a lot and it was like kind of inspiring words as well even though it's really simple and really really simple words with a simple meaning 
but it captivated my mind and I really wanted to share with you guys. My phone's like, I, I, it can't fall right now, it can't fall. <laughs> so she basically said how in life, you never lose. So like, she's telling me this, like don't view life as you're losing something, view it as you're always either winning or in other words, gaining something or you're learning from something. So when a negative situation happens or you're caught in a negative scenario or something, something that's not positive basically, don't view it as, as losing something, as you lost something, you lost a person, you lost an opportunity, you lost a job, you lost a physical, like an object or something like that. View it as in you learned from that Oh my god, this humongous truck is passing right next to me. That was kind of scary. <laughs> so never view the negative things in your life as losing something. Just view it as you gained something or you learned from it. Which is really good words to tell yourself when you're going to something that is not so positive or you're viewing it in a negative way and it's making you feel down. View it as you learned from it. It was a learning experience. You didn't lose anything from it. You gained. You learned from it. So yeah, I'll leave you guys with that one. I really want to know how you guys are doing. So please comment down below and let me know, like, what did you do today? What did you do during this week? I probably am going to post this tomorrow on a Friday. So let me know your Friday plans. I want to know, like, what you have planned for the weekend. As you guys know, I have a big weekend coming up. Um, I'm gonna have Sneaker Fest. I'm gonna put my kiosk over there in San Juan. I'm looking forward to the weekend. And this car's like really on my tail. Okay, no. I'm really looking forward to this weekend. I have really big plans and expectations for it, even though I'm trying really hard not to set expectations because I don't want to come out feeling um, bummed because I didn't sell as much as I planned to at the event. But like we said a couple minutes ago, it's a learning experience. I didn't lose anything, I didn't lose money, I didn't lose my time. I gained experience from it. I learned from it. Look at me! Improving! Something else that I would love for you guys to comment down below is let me know if you guys like long vlogs or short vlogs because I want to give you, I want to, I want to, I want you guys to enjoy the content that I'm creating and to enjoy the, the videos. Um, obviously, like I said before, I really like long videos. I like watching long videos. I enjoy making long videos as well, but if you guys don't really like watching really long videos then i'll try to like do a happy medium where it's like not too long but also longer than 10 minutes because i don't know why i really enjoy vlogs that are longer than 10 minutes <laughs> i'm home <laughs> so i just got home and sorry for all the mess i have a mess all over my room i really need to like I just have a lot of clean clothes just piled up everywhere that I need to put in the closet, like hang up in the closet and put in my drawers. And that's what I think I'm gonna do right now. I am gonna end the vlog here because I don't want this vlog to be way too long and just really random. It's already random as it is. Um, this weekend I plan on vlogging a lot, so that, that'll be fun and I'll, I could just put that in a separate vlog. So with that said, I'm gonna end this one here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're interested in buying Lost in Paradise um, merchandise, um, the links are down below. Here's the website. You can also follow me on my Instagram, which is Anton Castro, or my Lost in Paradise Instagram, which is Lost in Paradise Shop. I'd really appreciate it. <laughs> I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye.